what to see, what to rent, and what to skip. It's Movie Reviews with Ryan J. That's right. You already know it. So it's given away. We're so happy that it's Friday, not because it's the weekend, but because it means Ryan J is here and he's here on the Morning Blend every Friday. And we love it. He's a nationally syndicated film critic with millions of listeners and fans all over the country and all over Milwaukee and all oh, over the world. Wow, you make me sound like a legend. How does that feel? Good morning. Unreal. Again. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay, I'm excited. That was that was nice. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you so thank much. You. I, I'd like I to learning thank from the you. I'm taking your pageant. <laughs> Coaching classes, right? <laughs> and you're good at taking a compliment. But Great. All right, so you've got some good movies to review. This is one that I'm very excited about. Cameraman Dave went with his family. Yes. Captain America. The Winter Soldier. It's a sequel. It's in the Marvel family. And summer is here. Forget about spring. This is the quintessential summer blockbuster hitting in springtime. This movie is amazing. I was absolutely blown away. Really? It's the smartest, most intricate, interesting story of any superhero movie I've ever seen. Okay, so I've seen seen some of the clips that they just play on TV, like where they throw the, um, what's the it called? Shield. The shield. And the effects seem really cool. Are they cool? These effects are so amazing. Like, you take them for granted. You literally don't think that you're watching special effects. People are flying through the air. Things are blowing up. And you're just like, yeah, that's flying. This is happening. Like, there's, <laughs> it's so realistic and so amazing. So at a new level with this film that I am absolutely impressed. I love the former Captain America movies, and I feel like he's kind of come up the ranks as a superhero. Where do you think he fits in in, in that scheme? That's a really good question because, you know, people love the DC superheroes like yeah. Superman and Batman, and then here in Marvel we have Iron Man and Thor. This is better than the first Captain America. It's better than the first two Thor movies. It's as good as any Iron Man movie. The comedy and the romance and the action and the effects and the story also seamlessly blend. Mm -hmm. And Captain America, after this movie, is now on the radar. Hmm. He's one of my favorite superheroes. Never was before. Really? Was always, yeah, it's just kind of like around. Not even after the first one. Not even after the first. The first one didn't do anything for me. But oh this God, movie no. is brilliant. Like I can't wait to go see it again. I want to go now. Who's in Let's the cast? Go. Are there people that I'm not recognizing? Well, we have Chris Evans as, as Captain America, and he's amazing. Anthony Mackie. Um, we've got Scar Jo, Scarlett Johansson back as Black Widow, and I love their flirtation going on there. Was this before shoot? Because she's pregnant now. Do you know? If this, this was, was shot before. before okay. Right. And there's Samuel L. Jackson, who's genius, and this film has one of the coolest action scenes in a car you've ever seen in a movie. There's, there's a <laughs> Really cool elevator Wait, no, scene. no, because is it cooler than the scene where someone, the car is moving and someone steps out? Do you remember that scene? That was, I don't remember what movie that was. <laughs> that was amazing. That was like um, one of the uh, red movies or something. Yeah, there's somebody uh, know that. People are thinking but, of it. Yeah, that was really good. Better anyway, this, than that? This, it's better. This okay. is a see it. This is phenomenal. Go check it out on the big screen in 3D. You'll love it. Stay for the credits? Stay for the credits. Yes, there's two extra credit scenes, one halfway through and one at the very end, clues to upcoming Marvel movies. All right, this is one of the most excited I've seen you beside Oz, so see it. Jazzed I'm going to go up. see it as well. The next one I haven't heard of, I don't think, The Pirate Fairy, Rated G. Rated G. This is Disney, and it's direct to Blu-ray and DVD. It just came what out on Tuesday. G? It's easier than PG. It's oh, very okay. family friend friendly. It's approved for families. And this Join is from the world of Peter Pan. Jesus. It's sort of a soft prequel to Peter Pan, actually, and it's Tinkerbell and her friends. Okay. Do you like the animation? It's really cute. And what I was most impressed with the animation was all the pixie dust. And the story actually revolves around the origins and the uses of different pixie dust. But the way that it glows, you can see some of it. Mm -hmm. There, blue dust and the rainbow dust there. It glows and it's so magical and really cool. So this is kind of a group or a, a team of fairies. Yep, it's uh, Tinkerbell and her friends and they're off, you know, after these pirates and they're trying to get some stuff done. And I'm actually doing a giveaway yeah. associated with the, this film, I'm giving away a bunch of free copies of this movie, new on Blu-ray and DVD. And one lucky winner is going to get this amazing gift Aww. basket that has Rosetta and Zarina, a bunch of candy. We've got some pixie dust colored nail polish in there, oh. some Pop Rocks, the movies in there. And it's sort of like a nice Disney fairy Easter basket so for a lucky winner. How do people win it? Uh, my website, ryanjreviews.com. So you okay. can either win the movie or you'll win this gift basket. But that's exciting. Yeah. I love that one. Okay, so that's a must see? Yeah, or? definitely. It's worth seeing. I really, it's cute. See it it's for kids. Cute. Yes. All right, so Absolutely. that's that's or, a rent it. A rent it, yeah. Well, you can't, you know, you can buy it. Yes, perfect. All right, Blood Ties, rated R. Really interesting about this movie, it didn't get a major theatrical distribution nationwide, but I rented it on iTunes recently and it has such a cool cast. Clive Owen, Billy Crudup, Zoe Saldana, Marion Cotillard, Mila Kunis, James Caan, and it's a really gritty, cool drama. It looks like a period piece, is it? With it those is. chops? It is. It's actually 1974 Brooklyn, <laughs> okay. and it's a totally different look at that era than like the glitzy version that American Hustle showed us recently. Yeah. So it's a much grittier, darker version of 
of that era, but really nails the period. It actually looks like it was filmed in the 70s. Who's going to like this? Uh, it's rated R, and it's okay. dramatic, and I would have enjoyed it on the big screen, but it didn't get a theatrical release, so I'm saying it's a rental, so go ahead and rent Blood Ties. It's definitely worth a rent it. Um, but uh, I think, you know, adult audiences would enjoy a good drama. Okay, good. And it's nice to just stay in sometimes when it's rainy. Absolutely. Right? Maybe this afternoon, having yeah. your coffee, watching Blood Ties. It's on iTunes. And, mm -hmm. How about movie clubs? Because everybody wait patiently. They wait patiently for your movie clubs. It's, they do. They're so good sports. And I've got two coming up next week, but the one I'm featuring right now is Draft Day, the new Kevin Costner football movie. And you can enter to win. It's going to be on April 8th, which is Tuesday at 7 p.m. You enter to win at my website. But everybody that's going to be there is going to get some swag that I'm giving away. We've got three different kinds of t-shirts. Those are cool. A towel, a mug, oh. and a hat. So oh my gosh, everybody, I love this one. Look isn't this that cool? One. Yeah. And they that say draft do. day. They do say they, draft day. Do they have got, all the movie the stuff day, on The movie too? opens on Friday, April 11th, so it's you know a nice promotion for that. But uh, it's nice to be able to give away some some swag in addition yeah. to a free screening. Who doesn't love a free shirt? Yeah, good luck, everybody. Right. Enter to win. Sounds good. Thanks, Ryan. Thank you, too. All right, you can like Ryan Jay on Facebook, follow him on Twitter, and for his full movie reviews and to enter those contests, check out his website, ryanjreviews.com and that Facebook page.